Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel Reviews with Sue. If you're an existing subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. And if you're not, why not subscribe? All you gotta do is hit that little red button that's right over there and next to that there's a bell. If you ring the bell and hit all, each time I upload a new video, you receive notification of that. So, would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, let me tell you, it is the BoxyCharm Premium and I received my one of my pop-up sale items. So if you'd like to know what's inside this bag, in this box, keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's so Sue. you did decide to stick around to see what's inside my BoxyCharm box this month. Now, if you're not familiar with BoxyCharm, what it is, it is a monthly beauty subscription box. Now, there's three different levels to BoxyCharm. There's the base box, then there is the premium box, which is the one I have today, and then there's the Lux. So in order to get the premium box, you do have to first subscribe to the base box, and that's $25. This one's $35. Once you are subscribed to this one, then you can let go of the base box if you choose to, or you can get both. And then every three months, they offer the Lux box, and that one is $50. But when you get that box, you forego your base box, if that makes any sense. If anybody has any questions about it, let me know in the comments below and I can answer any question that you might have. So this is the premium box, it's $35. It's supposed to contain at least $175 worth of items and it is going to contain, I think it's six to seven items in the box. So this month, this box is really light. I wanna say it was like 1.2 pounds or something. Such a big box, it feels light as a feather. I did see some unboxings, I will not lie. And the products are kinda eh. At least I know the one item I'm gonna get, we always get a choice item. And the choice item I'm gonna get is basically gonna pay for the box, so whatever else I get is basically kinda of like bonuses, I guess you could say. Whoops, I just tilted the box and I could hear things moving around in there. So anyways, let me go ahead and get into this box for you guys today, because I know that's why you're here. But if you do have any questions about it, just let me know. Okay, so when you open up the box, it says BoxyCharm Premium, and it's always in a blue box. And then you always get a card, and then you hmm, then you have your products inside, and this is what it looks like. I mean, these are my products right here, and everything else is empty. There's a blue foam, which helps protect your items, which is always a good thing, because sometimes there are glass items in there. So this month, the theme is Mother Nature, and it's got a bunch of flowers on there, and that is what the card looks like. And then, oh good, on the back side of my card, it does have all the items that are gonna be included in my box, along with the retail prices, as well as a brief description about it. So I usually don't go into too much detail, so if you have any big questions or anything about any of the items, just leave me a comment below and I will get back with you. Let's go ahead and get into the box. So I'm going to start off with my choice item. I'm, each month, or each box I should say, you get to choose one item out of the box. So there's a certain day that they tell you that you know your choice is gonna be available, and usually everybody goes in at the same time and it's hard to get into choice but you just got to keep on trying and they usually give you a choice of maybe like three items so at least you know you're gonna like one of the items in there as long as you like one of those three items and you want to get in there quickly because some of the times the items sell out so the item that I chose is this Too Faced chocolate gold bronzer so this is what it looks like and originally they had told us that this was going to come in a matte formula i believe and then they sent us an email because we had chose it and said no it's not going to be the matte it's going to be the shimmer so i was a little bit nervous about it but i thought you know i love bronzers i love Too Faced, and i love chocolate because that's what these smell like so on the back of this box it says our best-selling chocolate bronzer just went to gold bathe your skin in this long wearing gold glow with this cocoa powder infused bronzer created with real shimmering gold that smells like a chocolate dream and that sounds like a chocolate dream so i am excited let's see what the price is on this one is thirty dollars so basically this item is thirty dollars my box was 35 and let's give it a try oh the color on this is luminous i believe that's what it says luminous so let's take her out and see what she looks like. Oh, it is really pretty. I don't know if you're gonna get a glare on it, but this is what it looks like here. And then, oh, cute. It has like a little heart there to open it up. So let's see, how does this open? Oh, there we go. Ooh, is that pretty? It has a mirror and then it says chocolate. It says chocolate gold. You can see that there. 
and oh and it smells like chocolate so that is awesome so I'm hoping this is gonna be dark enough let me do a quick swatch hmm I don't know if this is dark enough for me or not but there it is there on my hand it smells okay. it smells so good so there it is there and I think I am going to like this item so let me show you one more time there it is it is kind of smooth it's creamy and and it, and it smells good I probably have it all over my nose now but anyways I am very happy to get this item let's see oh it's kind of weird it closes but it's not like oh I guess it's like magnetic who know who knew it was gonna be magnetic okay so that is our first item now let's move on and let's see what else we got here we have by Kat Von, Kat Von D it is the inkwell liner and uh oh this is in dark wave inkwell dark wave and I'm thinking this is gonna be a blue which is kind of scary for me because I am not that adventurous is what I meant to say. And let's see, what is the price on this guy? This is the Kat Vegan Beauty Ink Well Liquid Liner valued at $20. Well, let's just take a look at it. I probably am not gonna swatch it only because, odds are I'm not gonna use this. Well, you never know. If I'm playing one night and I'm bored, maybe I'll give it a whirl and see what happens. But. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, if it looks anything like this, it is a cute container though. This is what it looks like here. And yeah, I don't think I want to open it yet, but I am maybe going to try it. It says long wear matte eyeliner. So we got us a bright blue, maybe even purple or periwinkle or something like that. But it's pretty, but I just don't know if I can wear it on my eyes or not. What do you guys think? Seriously, I have brown eyes, brown hair, darker complected. Would blue be a color for me because... I'm kind of thinking it's not, but who knows? Tell me guys in the comments below, do you think blue anything would look good on my eyes or around my eyes? So there is that product. So, I mean, I'm happy to get an eyeliner. I just kind of wished it was like in black or brown. I mean, I would have been happy with brown, even though I usually wear blacks. All right, moving on. So the next item I am pulling out is a mascara and it is by Kevin Aquan or a coin, something like that. It is the Expert Mascara, and it is 0.39 fluid ounces, and it is in the color black. Yay, I'm glad it didn't give us anything too funky with that one, because that's all I wear is black mascaras. So let me take a look at it. I know we have been getting so many eyeliners and mascaras, and well, the packaging's really pretty. It's a nice gold. You can't probably read it or see it there in the finder, but it is a nice sleek gold mascara. So the cost on this guy is $29 holy crap that's a lot of money 29 bucks for a mascara well I heard that he's good so if he's good then I guess we're gonna try it so we have that item okay moving on the next item we have is just this little baby here it is a baby milk there you go there and it is in the color Astro not have excuse me I don't have any idea what Astro would look like but we are going to take a peek at it so this particular item here is da, da, da. it is the milk makeup glow oil lip and cheek it is a value of $15 and so this can, you can actually wear on your cheeks and it's buildable as well as you can use it as like a lip gloss so oh look it I think it, com it comes with these little baby instructions <laughs> look it oh my gosh this is like so tiny it's like the size of a little tag that would be on your clothing so let's pop her out of there oh it is really cute. Look how cute it is. I, I do like the packaging on it. I mean, it's small enough that you can stick it in your purse, no problem. So let's see, does this screw off? I don't even know how this opens. Oh yeah, okay, so it looks, did it screw? Yes, it does have a screw top and it does have like a little plastic protector on here. So let's see if I can get that. There we go, got it off. Ooh, it's actually really pretty. Let's see here. So this is the color, this is what it looks like. Kind of matches my nail polish a little bit there. Um, let's give it a try. Okay, so, ooh. Well, it's kind of like an iridescent almost. I don't know if you can see it there. Hmm. Interesting, I'm trying to get a, a good look at it and it's hard, can you see it? I mean, I already have, well, what the hell? <laughs> We're just gonna, Put it right on over what I already have. Now, I don't know if you can see anything from that or not, but 
it's actually really pretty. I am kind of happy to have it. I'm not gonna put it on my cheeks right now, but if it adds a little bit of shine and it's kind of like a lip balm, then I kind of like it. I mean, $15 though, I don't know if, you know, that would be like a premium item for a premium box, but, but I do like it and I will use it. So, I mean, the odds are I'm gonna reach for this before I reach for this or for this. So, I'm happy with it. So cool, I am liking that item. All right, and I did say the value on that was $15. And my last item, I think this is my last item. Hmm. Okay, just sorry. I was just peeking in my box because I think I'm missing an item. But okay, so the next item we have is by Sugar Rush. It is Tarte Best Bud Lip Butter Balm. So it is in Peony. And there it is there. And let's pop her open and see what she looks like. Oh, look at the inside packaging. It's got little daisies in there. That's cute. I love packaging. I love the, oh, this is so cute. Look at, I got me a little flower. And we're gonna pop it out. And, yep, it's, um, okay, yep, that's what it looks like. So this is it here. And then you got the bottom. And let me just kinda take a look. Oh, and it does say Sugar Rush right here on the front. And let's kinda take a look at it. Oh, it does smell really good, you know, but I'm not going to um, swatch this or use it right now because I've got like three layers on my lips as it is. And um, I don't know if I'm going to use this product only because I don't like dipping my fingers into things. I'd rather it be a lip balm, a lipstick. You know, if I'm at work, it's kind of gross. I'm swiping my fingers in there and then putting it on my lips. So I'm not sure if I'm going to reach for it, but I love the packaging. It is so cute. Very cute. Uh, the retail value on this item is $12. So, one, two, three, four, five. So I got five items in my box. So I did get the Kevin Aquan. Let's see, Kevin Aquan or Kevin Aquan. So we have this item here. We got the Too Faced item here. I received the Milk Lip and Cheek Oil. Okay, um, I am missing I am missing my Baddington Beauty Powder and Contour Brush Set, valued at $90. So, I guess I'm gonna be given a little email or however we try to tell them, BoxyCharm anyways, that I didn't get all my items because I'm missing that. So, oh, I'm so bummed. I don't know if I'm gonna use them, but I still like them. I mean, it's a $90 value, that's probably half the value of the box because everything else here was, you know, 15, 20 bucks, I'd say. But moving on, um, the Tarte Sugar Rush, we got this item and we got the um, KVD Beauty Vegan Ink Well Liquid Liner in blue. So out of all these items, I am going to say my favorite item is, I'm sure you guys can guess by the expressions that I've been using on my face because sometimes I have a hard time showing my feelings. But my favorite item is this Too Faced Bronzer. I'm hoping that it's gonna work because I currently use the Tarte Princess Palette, I think it's called. It's like a big brick and it looks like a, a Willy Wonka chocolate bar and it is my favorite. If I could get my hands on another one of those, I would. So if anybody knows where you can get those fairly cheap, because I'm cheap, because I don't really like to buy a lot of stuff because I get so many different subscription boxes. So if anybody knows where I can get that cheap, let me know in the comments down below. So this is my very favorite item. And then my second favorite item, I think is actually this little Milk $15 mini item. So I am very happy with those two. The other three things that I've received so far, I, I don't know if I'm gonna reach for them right away. I know I won't be using them in the near, near future, but you know, I always have giveaways and I, you know, give things, you know, I, I trade with people or I give it to my family members. So I'm just gonna hold on to these for right now. And um, yeah, that's my box. So I don't know what the total value is. I will give you the value, um, like, you know, somewhere in here of what the total amount of, of this box is. And then I did wanna do a little bit of a recap on some items that I had received in previous boxes. Now, we had a box that was by Fenty. It wasn't my favorite box, I will admit. But I am telling you, this item right here is my favorite item out of the box. It is like a lip gloss and I wear it like all the time. I wear it all the time. Let's see, it's in the color Diamond Milk. I love these kind of toppers. So what I'm wearing it with today is one of my 
Maybelline products that I have purchased recently, and it's the, the Super Stay Matte Ink, and it's called Lover. So this is Lover, so that is what's on my lips right now, along with this on top of it, and then with the milk on top of that. <laughs> so I just wanted to share with you guys that I do really like this item. I'm not sure if I used anything else out of that box. And then last month, I was so excited because I received the Lunar Beauty Life's a Dry Color Palette because I know a lot of people were you know, jealous that I got that because a lot of people didn't get that item and they didn't even get a palette in it. So I was happy to get it and I did use it. I'm not wearing it, but I'm happy to get it. And um, so I have been using that item and the other one is the Peach and Lily Good Acid Acids Pore Toner. And this is what it looks like. I have been using it, so you can see that some of it's gone. I had finished up another one and started this, and I am enjoying this, and I was so thrilled and happy I got this. This was one of those other things that I didn't like what the choice was, so I didn't make a choice, and this was one of them, and it was already sold out, and then I just happened to get it, so I was, like, so happy. So I got that item, and then, let's see. Oh, I got my, we had a pop-up sale, or not we, BoxyCharm had a pop-up sale not too long ago, and I was driving home from my second home and it wasn't up, it wasn't up. So I kept refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. And finally, it popped up that it was, that I could get in because it was jammed, I'm sure. So I pull over on an exit, I get out of my car, or not get out of my car, I, you know, put my car in park, I got in there. And so I wanted to get a few items and I was panicking because I didn't know if it was gonna boot me out again. So these are the items that I did purchase out of that. And I know I couldn't, and I couldn't figure out what shade I was because there was something that I just love. And let me see, did I get everything out of there? Yeah. So I ended up getting, this was in one of our boxes. Oopsie, <laughs> I thought my box was gonna fall. We got this in one of our previous BoxyCharm boxes. And I think it was one of my favorite ones. It was a base box and I think I even liked it better than the premium. And this is by the Brow Bar. It is the True Brow, Brow Makeover Kit. And it came just like this. If you can see, let me open it up and show it to you because I am so excited for this. So it comes with three different colors here for your brows. And then it comes with a brow gel, I believe this is. I think this was a little brow gel. And then it even came with a little baby, a brush. But I didn't use the brush. And I don't even know if I've used this gel yet, but I use this every day on my eyebrows, so I'm going to show you my eyebrows. This is how they look. What do you guys think? Do you like my brows? But I do, um, I love it. And I didn't know which color I was. And this is the medium. And then I also purchased the dark because I wasn't sure which one it was. And then when I got home, I realized that the dark is the one I wear. So this here, well, here, let me open it up so you don't have to take the glare. So this is the dark. Let me just pop these out of here. So that middle one that's almost black, that is the shade that I wear on my eyebrows. And actually, it's my natural color. So my natural color of my hair is real dark brown. I put highlights in it. I got gray in it. So don't look up here because that's where all the gray is. It's either there or I have a, a can of spray paint, basically, that... um. I spray my grays with the brown temporarily. So, so I end up getting two in the dark because I was thinking I was the dark and then I got one in medium just in case. So the next item I am pulling out that I received in my boxy pop-up was the Lux Luxie Face Essentials Rolled Gold Collection. Look at that, isn't it beautiful? I know I just purchased another one not too long ago and I did open it up, I used it, and then I saw this one, I'm like, oh no, I think I want this one now. So those were the items that I purchased. I thought it was gorgeous, so I purchased this. Now, the one thing is, um, I am starting to get close to my 1,000 subscribers, so if you haven't subscribed yet, please do. It would help my channel out so much, because that's my goal, is to get to 1,000. And when I have my 1,000 giveaway, I'm thinking about putting some really nice brushes in there. So I might save these for myself, but I might give them away in my 1,000 subscri subscriber giveaway. So anyways, if you haven't checked out my channel recently, I have done a few giveaways. I have a giveaway ending on May 25th, and I will put a link right up here for that. And that will give you, that will get you to the channel that has the giveaway in it. It is a collab that I did with Random Reviews with Stephanie, and the collab was called the Random Unboxing Collab. 
and it was so fun. You guys gotta check it out. I was so excited during that because I got some awesome things. And then we have a giveaway at the end. But make sure you watch the whole thing because there's something special that you have to put into the comments. And then I have another giveaway, which is my 700 subscriber giveaway, and that one's ending on June 10th. So I will leave a link for that one up here as well. So check that one out too. So you have to be subscribed, it has to be on public. Check those videos out, see if there's anything in those giveaways that you might be interested in because you could be the winner because these giveaways are my, is my way of giving back to you guys and I just appreciate it so much. You, would, you wouldn't even believe. I am having so much fun doing these videos and rattling on and I think I've rattled enough for today. So let's see, do we have anything else to go over? I don't think so except for I'm going to contact BoxyCharm to see where my brushes are because I want them because I might give them away I might keep them because I haven't touched them yet, so I don't know. So anyways, that is the conclusion of my video today. Thank you so much for listening to me rattle on. If you made it to the end, put in the comments below, True Trooper, because I like to see True Trooper on there because then I know everybody watched the whole video because it helps my channel. It helps it when you do comments, it helps it when you give me a thumbs up, and I really think that's it now. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and. Be safe, stay well, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.